yo, what is up, my homies and inwards and I don't know, whatever my YouTube intro was. Can we just, uh, you know, can we just forget that existed? Anyways, today I wanted to make a tier list of my personal running uh, libraries in Forza, like the libraries that I use the most often. So that's the agenda for this video and we're just gonna hop right into it. I've thrown all of these in and we're just gonna go with it. So we start off with this AMC Gremlin. I honestly don't know who this is, but my first thoughts on this is, well, it's a Gremlin has pink wheels it doesn't really belong but the anime itself looks all right i'm i'm gonna give it a c oh i should mention that when i'm done with this i'm gonna go through each tier and organize them like first to last and how good they are but i just want to place them first anyways next up we've got this aston martin who we got there and it's hard to see had to downscale a bit I don't even know who's on that, but it looks pretty nice. The rims are a nice complement to the color, I'd say. I'm going to give that A tier, I think. And then we've got Nino from Quintessential Quintuplets on an R8. Very good anime, very good car. But no, it's tier. You can't know it. My Sacagawea on a different R8. I don't like that camper. Like, or not camper. What is that? Like a carry, carry case? Maybe? I don't know. My Sacagawea is good. That's not. I'm sorry, my, but. A. We've got an S. It's an Audi RS7 or something. S7, maybe? Don't know who that is, but it looks pretty nice. So, we're gonna give it a B. It looks alright. Car's not good. Unknown anime. Once again, don't know who this is. Good car. Don't know who this is. Looks kinda weird, though. I'm gonna have to go with B. Okay. Here we go. We've got an E92 M3 with Yor from Spy X Family. Easy S tier. And it just blends so perfectly as well. That was a little too zoomed in. Okay, who have we got here? That's as much as I can zoom in. I can't tell what that is, but it's an E36 M3. I love me a BMW. That's got to go A tier, even though it's meh. The car itself, amazing. Okay, so we've got 0 2 on an E46 M3. I love the E46, probably my favorite BMW chassis. I personally own one, even though it literally is lower than this one right now, so you can't hardly drive it. S tier because I love me some zero two. Then an E30 M3 with zero two. E30 is not as good, but the paint job itself is phenomenal. Like it just, okay, what have I done? It's just minimalistic, but still nice. Okay, here we go. C10 Stingray with zero two. I'm gonna go ahead and say it. Probably the best one I've, I have seen yet at all in the game. Top of S tier. I don't even like that car, but that paint job is phenomenal. Then whatever this is on another like a C8, I think. I'm going to go A with that one. It looks nice. Car sucks. If it's American, it just needs to go straight to the dump, honestly. In my humble opinion. And then we've got this. I like this fade. I don't like this Camaro and I don't like the pink rings, but I do like the carbon fiber hood. So we're going to give it A. 
We've got zero two on a C4 Corvette, I think. It's a Z06, but I think it's C4. No, it's too new to be C4. It's probably like C6. It's still zero two on an American car. I can't put zero two below A tier. I can't bring myself to do it. Okay, so we've got a Deberti Tacoma, I think is what this was, with something and the most horrendous rims known to mankind. That one's going D tier. I don't care for it. It literally gave me the Forza Vista intro when I used it, so I've never used it before. Like, when I say used, just to get that picture. Okay, so we've got an anti-traction machine. <laughs> with a decent waifu and not terrible rims. I'm gonna give it a C. Then we've got a vomit machine with vomit rims and mid anime. That's my next D tier. I don't like trucks. Okay, so we have a crowd crasher with a decent waifu. Very large tires. And a Decent color combo. Put that one on B. It looks alright. Looks alright. Okay. Another crowd crasher. I like this fade. The rims aren't terrible. Um, I have no idea what the medium of this is. I like that there's Japanese right on the taillight. But like not overdone. I think that one deserves B van like i don't know what this is I don't like the rims it's a van it's hot pink just get it out of my sight okay so another unknown anime character on a fastback i i think fastbacks are all right and i like the fade the rims kind of fit and i can't scroll over to the side anymore and i don't feel like opening the game but, I think that one's a solid C. And then the next one looks like the same car, but we got High School DXD. High School DXD was nice. I'm put that on B. Okay. So we've got a Type R with... What is that? Is that maybe Nightmare from Day Day Live? It's possible, but I doubt it. Anyway, I like the white, black, and red. Okay. S2000. It's an interesting color combo on an S2000. Great rim choice. Don't know who that is, but it looks nice. It's gonna it's gonna go A as well. Then this is flashy, like something you would. This looks like something you would see at a uh, car meet with a turbo that's in that's installed wrong. So <laughs> th that's gonna go C for me, Chief. Okay, and then we have another S2000. Looks like the chick from World's End Harem. And I like this fragmentation effect, not terrible rims, slick top. If it was convertible, it'd be down a tier. I hate convertibles. I really do. So, I'm going B with this one. Okay. NSX is a nice car, but I don't like baby blue. Like, at all. So, that's going to be my next D tier. And the next thing we've got is a Q50. That actually blends well. I should have taken these pictures like at nighttime or something, but that blends well. Nice rims. Not like burn your eyes out in the daytime pink. Mm. Uh, I think that's a B. I think it's a B. Looks pretty fair so far. Then we've got this Jeep. Uh, it looks pretty plain, like you just put a sticker on it. Once again, it's kind of a truck, so... Truck-related goes D-tier. I'm gonna go ahead and just put the G-Wagon there, too. 
It's tall enough to give you body roll when you've lowered it. That's it, Chief. No more. Anyways, this Lambo. What's on this Lambo? I legit cannot even. Let's look through the actual files and figure this out. There you are. Oh yeah, that's a lot easier to tell. Hmm. I don't mind it, but I don't like these rims. And I, I like the black background. Like, I, I wish it was more black. Unless, like, more of the cars were black and not, like, pink and crap. I think it's nice. I'm going to give it... I'm going to give it A tier. Solid. Not over the top like the C8, but solid. We've got another Lambo. Once again, I cannot tell what the heck is going on. What is, why is it not opening here? This doesn't make a lot of sense. Yudachi. I have no idea what that's from. Black, red, and blue, all seamless and way better rims. That one's going to S tier. I like that one. Okay, and then we've got a Sesto. Meh, that one's going B. Look at the nasty rims. This pick, this um, like honeycomb effect for no reason. Pink under the hood scoops. Like, I think I could go into the bathroom trash can right now and pick out something prettier than that, honestly. That one's going D. Like, I have no idea why I'm running that at all. Okay, so the next thing is... What even is that? Hold on. Oh, RCF. That's name Miku by the looks of it. I think that one's just too over-cluttered with, like, random decals to be... To even be A tier. But it is nice, so I'm gonna have to put it on B. And then we've got, okay, an RX-8. Once again, over cluttered, but nice choice of rims and color, plus ReZero. Like, if you've watched ReZero, you know what I mean. When I, all I gotta do is say ReZero and you know it can't be lower than A. Solid choice. We've got this. We're gonna take the car out of the equation because this is on like every car known to mankind only put it once it's just some generic purple person like, it's all right didn't do anything to the rims but you see it everywhere and it's meh i'm giving it a b i'm gonna change b to meh because that's like literally all of them all of them that go there are just meh okay so next one looks like another rx7 Get it out. Nice color combo. Not sure why they went with gold for the rims. Kind of looks overly black. Though. As in human, not the color. Anyways. Still. I gotta go A with it because it does look nice. We got another RX7 here. Ooh, 0 2. Didn't go with gold rims. In fact, stock Mazda rims. I like that. I like that a lot. That one's going to have to go S tier as well. Like, we'll mess with zero too, man. Is that another RX-7? No, it's a Miata. It's a little cat. A little cat-like mouth thing. This looks like a nice rally, a nice rally paint job. Like you get it covered in mud and it just works better. So it's not bad at all. Got black and white paint flows together. Got some Japanese lettering there. Can we close this? Thank you. You can go A tier. I don't mind it. Ooh, we got an FC. FC is nice. 
Um, I did not like Kaguya, and I don't like this like, at all. Rims are mid at best. Paint job is mid at best. It's gonna have to go C. Ooh, a zero two Lancer. Okay, I see you. Blurry. But no, I think that's just the photo itself. A little bit too much convolution with this Bridgestone, Red Bull, Racing Games, Atlas BX, Alpine. Bridgestone, Toyo. Like, I came here to see the anime, not all of your advertisements. So, best I can give it's A, but honestly, the advertisements. There's so many. I'm giving it meh. And then we got another Lancer. What's this? Okay. I don't know what that's from, but it's nice. Better not be Genshin. Not a fan of Genshin. I don't see Mihoyo anywhere, so it's probably not Genshin. Again, with the over-the-top advertisements, like, this is a car, not a billboard. I'm gonna give that one A, because it's really nice art, but it could have been S. Could have been. But they chose to not. We got another ReZero rim. There's not as many advertisements. I wouldn't say it's off-putting. I like the ReZero. Rim is not as good as Amelia. Don't even try me. But anyways, very nice. Nice plain rims, not flashy. Got some Japanese on the on the wing. Kept the paint going on the hood. I I I'd give this one an A. I feel like that's where it goes. It's A. Okay, then we've got this GTR. Keep the dream alive, red, white, and blue. And then just advertising crap all over the entire thing. D. Best I can give you is a D. And let's see what this Z's got. Ooh. I like that. That fits really nicely. Chrome rims, white, like literally the hood's left untouched. Wide body. Got this extending down onto the bumper. Could have maybe touched, or it's onto the diffuser. Could have gone on the bumper so it didn't just cut off, but I understand the game's got limitations. If it wasn't for this, I'd give it S. I'm gonna have to give it. I'm gonna have to give it A though. Best I can do for it because that's that's strange. Very strange. Ooh, I don't even know what that is. What is that? 240SX. Is that a Genshin character? I have no idea what that is. It has one anime character, and then the rest of it's just rainbow vomit of advertisements, so... It's not a lot I'm going to be able to do for that. Plus, look at that alignment. This, this must be one of those over-the-top drift builds, because, like, the thing looks like it's designed to walk. Anyways, we're not rating on that criteria. That's just a side note. That one is just advertiser vomit. Vomit, not vomit. Okay, so we've got... Uh, is that a Nissan or a Volvo? Probably a Volvo. Nah. I could have almost designed that. I can't give you much credit when your artwork reflects something I can do in MS Paint. So... D tier. Sorry, Chief. And then next is our Pagani here. I love the high-res art on this. In the black. It's a little bit of advertising, but, you know, that's a good amount. The anime name, I'm assuming. And Union might be the character's name, so. I'm gonna give this S. This 
that resolution really makes it stand out. Okay, so next we got a Porsche. Mm, artwork's decent, and it's definitely minimalistic, but these rims... Looks like you stuck them in a blender with a bunch of fruit. So, not that great. Plus, it might be overly minimalistic if I'm being completely honest. Let's go to the next Porsche. Okay, we got Zero Two in a in her Frank suit. Very minimalistic, but not as much as the other one. Like it kind of flows. You can tell there's even something up there and something on the back. There's some advertising stuff, but the artwork would be better if it was made to reminisce that of the show. This kind of overly CG, if you ask me. So, I might have to give this uh, like, like a B tier. It, it's mid. It's not bad, but it's definitely mid. Yeah, it looks like we got another Porsche. Okay. I don't know who those are, but they both look like Nightmare from Day to Life. Nice rims. Nice artwork. Not over the top with the... You know, the advertising vomit still kept the Porsche logos. And plus the color choice. Mm, I think we found our next contender for S, boys. That's very nice. And another Porsche. This one looks like it went into a 12-year-old girl's bedroom and did not come out alive. So... And give that one a C. It's got nice artwork, but the, it just doesn't flow at all. And this one. Because they couldn't do deal with this black, or if they could, they didn't. Whatever the case is, it does not flow that well either. But good artwork. And it flows better than that other one. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put this above that other one at a B meh whatever but oh <laughs> not from the file explorer but that's already possibly stretching it we've got what have we got here WRX Marine Kitagawa pink rims are overdoing it to say the least and also this, whatever this is. Very good art and not overkill with the advertisements. So if we had ignored this, it'd be S tier. But this is minus a tier. <laughs> that already puts it to A tier. That's probably as low as I can go with it. I'd say, I'd say it's A tier. Looks like we've got a Supra and a GR left. Like a GR86. Supra. Bland, but nice art. Doesn't fit together. <laughs> it doesn't fit together at all. And the rims. Rims are nice. I'm going to give this one a C because... Actually, no. I'm giving that a D because honestly... D what? I guess all I can say is What? And then our last contender for the list. This. I love the way this flows. Really do. Yeah, it's got way too many advertisements, but this already looks like more of a drift build to begin with. I think it kind of flows with the aesthetic. And then this art, man. This art is nice. That's our last one and also our last S. In my book. I just settled in my drink. Interesting. So I guess now we're going to go ahead and uh, even them out. I already told you that this is top. Can't beat it. Nino. I, I think this goes above me. I guess I got to zoom out. I think, I think your goes above Nino. 
So does Zero Two. Not this one because this is kind of overly minimalistic compared to compared to like just the art style on this. And as far as the S's go, this is definitely dead last. Nothing wrong with it, but it's just not that good. And this is going to be right in front of it. Actually, no, that's... I'm putting it like that. I'm going to put this right after Nino. No. No, right there. I really like that, actually. The more I look at it. I'm going to put this back. Okay, yeah, I think that's going to be my S. Actually, no, 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 no. I'm going to do it like this, because I do really like the resolution on this, and this is still very rainbow vomit. I have too much of a partiality towards E46s, so I got to watch myself. But honestly, we are going to... Swap these guys' places. I think we're going to do it like that. Sorry, E46. Then on down to A. This is definitely top of A. I think this is... No, this is going to go here. I like these three a lot. We got to put 0 to... <sighs> I would, but I'm sorry. That's just kind of very mid. I'm going to put her here. I like, uh, I do like the art on this. Nothing else. Then this is going to go lower. We'll even that out later. Type R needs to go there. It's very nice. Hmm. Zero. Put it like that. Quite minimalistic. Fits pretty decently. And then we're going to put the E36 above zero two. It's just not that good of a zero two paint. Like, honestly, this flows pretty decently considering the colors they chose. I'd be willing to put it here. This Lambo's definitely got to go above it. I think this one might keep that. Okay, then for meh. Out of the mehs, this is this is top. Like it wasn't that bad. And then this is good filler when you have nothing else. But I do kind of like the way this looks. I'm going to do it like this. This is strange to say the least. So is this. I'm going to put this bottom. Like that, that deserves bottom and that deserves next to bottom. Because they're both, they just don't flow at all. Like you can't even hardly understand what's going on here. Like I might understand it better if I put my hands up to it and tried to read it like it was braille honestly. Then I'm going to put, I'm going to put her here. Like, I don't mind that. I'm going to make this be here. And then all of these are just like, in this order of, I don't know why they're here. Like, on this list. And then for C tiers, this has to go bottom. What are they? Porsche is better than that. Porsche is better than that. Both of these. These are both like they went into that respective color of art room. Did not make it out alive until a coroner found them. And this is a, just an anti-traction machine. It's simple. I don't mind it. I would. I, I'm okay running it, so it's good. Then... D tier, D tier. This is going top of D tier because at least there's some usability until we go further down the list. Same here, like the hexagons are reverse that even. 
This, we'll put it right after. And this right after that. But then as we go, as I'm looking through the rest, I am discovering that this is better than both of those. Like, yeah, it's a cheat, but the simplism makes it better than like this, that just like autistic kids fever dream. Dead bottom. And then I would put this in between these two trucks, I'd say. This one is okay. This one is just rainbow vomit. Then rainbow vomit. I'll put it here. Yeah. Rainbow vomit. Genshin. Disgusting. Let me zoom this back out. And I'm going to change these for good, good riddance. God tier. Giga Chad. Actually, no. Alpha. Sigma. Beta. Fringe. And finally, wouldn't touch with a 44. Yep, well, that's the list. I'm gonna go ahead and save that. List of car. Oh, excuse me. Download image, please. We're just gonna share it to, our, to this Discord community because I can. There, I keep pressing shift. All right, then. Well, that's the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Now it's time for me to go edit a absolutely over the top berserk X outro thing because that's what I always do, and it always erapes you. I'm aware of this. Anyways, thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all of the above things that YouTubers say. Honestly, I don't care. I'm making this just for fun. Peace. Oh, 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 oh,